рассмотрел, посмотрел мой эксклюзивный контракт с UFC, они даже сказали, что давай мы из тебя сделаем где-то в Европе, или в, а, а, так скажем, а, в, в этом регионе, не в Америке, а бой с Мейвезером, мы можем подраться и без UFC, можем турнир сделать. Да, они тебя осудят, а будет, будет, будут тебя судить, но можно штрафы на выплаты, даже на такие условия идут. Ну, знаете, я же сделал соглашение, я же подписал договор, так что для меня договор дороже денег, и мы не можем просто так. Ассаламу алейкум, guys, and welcome to a long overdue video, I would say, on the legend they call... My name is Conor McGregor. Habib Narmagomedov. Douche! Uh, that's a gen, yeah. <laughs> Just when I think this guy can't surprise me, guess what he does? Uh, he's, he surprises you? Yes! That's exactly it! As you know, Habib Narmegomedov is a practicing Muslim and he openly professes the influence Islam has on his daily life. <laughs> And seen as the Quran is an instruction manual for how we live our life, naturally the Quran has something to say about honoring the contract. In chapter 5 verse 1 Allah says, O oh, you who believe, fulfill your contracts. Yeah, And there's many other verses and hadith which also tell us the same thing. I don't think you guys understand what's actually going on. Here you have people that have told Habib, look, you're gonna get fined. No worries mate, we're gonna take the fine because the money, the fame and the opportunities that you're gonna get from this are on another level mate. And the only reason Habib says no is because of a moral reason. The fact that he doesn't want to break an agreement. <laughs> Habib himself is not as known as Floyd and this fight would have certified Habib. What could be more valuable than money I hear you ask? What could be more valuable than fame? That's the problem guys. That's the thing that we don't understand. Allah, obeying Allah and our relationship with Allah, God, is more valuable anything and everything. And the problem arises when a person doesn't have this attachment to God. There is a void and then we use money, fame and this sort of stuff to fill in that void. That's where the problems come from. Yeah, It's like a hole in the wall and you're filling it with newspaper and all kinds of garbage. That's not really going to do much. Eventually, there's going to be more problems in the building because you didn't fill in that crack. So when problems arise, you've got to fill it with the right thing, which is your relationship with Allah. And you notice your building, your body, your mind, your spirit will stay solid, mate. And that's the thing that Habib finds more valuable. And that's why it's so easy for Habib to put everything to the side and say, you know what? Yeah, it's not worth it, mate. It's not worth it. Yes, it's not worth it. I don't want to jeopardize my relationship with the Almighty because he's given me everything. And when it comes to money guys, everyone struggles, especially businessmen. That's right, to find a truthful and trustworthy businessman is a big thing nowadays. And that's why in a hadith of the Prophet, there is such great virtue for a truthful and trustworthy trader. The honest and trustworthy merchant will be with the prophets, the truthful and the martyrs. That's right, on the day of judgment. Yes, indeed. Yeah, when it comes to money, you see people selling their bodies, displaying themselves on these adverts and you know what I'm saying, in these movies doing really silly things. This is number one bullshit. Why? Just because of the money, just because of fame. A person that doesn't stand for something will fall for anything. And that's what these people don't realize that money is a means to wealth, not the wealth itself. You know, true wealth 
is having somebody that loves you yeah having family having morals having a purpose these things are wealth but it's unfortunate that our understanding of wealth is just the dosh the dollar and the dime and that's why you had people like Pablo Escobar and even these uh, spy agencies they say everybody has a price yeah you name your price but somebody that cannot be bought is a force to be reckoned with and may Allah make us that very exception that exception like Habib my name is Conor McGregor I'll leave it there guys until next time Assalamu <laughs> Alaikum